Over the weekend, President Biden said he's ready to take action <laughs> if Congress is serious about solving the border issue. She joined some 41. If that bill were the law today, I'd shut down the border right now and fix it quickly. And Congress needs to get it done. Starting another fucking war. <laughs> <laughs> MSNBC's Let's go down. Here we go. Rough Monday started with Joy Reid. Um, uh, I guess she's a friar. You'll see. <laughs> she's caught in a hot mic chastising uh, Joe Biden's foreign policy. Over the weekend, President Biden said he's ready to take action <laughs> if Congress is serious about solving the border issue. She joined some 41. If that bill were the law today, I'd shut down the border right now and fix it quickly. And Congress needs to get it done. Starting another fucking war. <laughs> <laughs> Still trying to kill the deal. <laughs> uh, whoops. Uh, oh, excuse me. She, 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 you see that? You see the hair? She looks like yeah, Fryer like... Dump. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice. Pretty good. <laughs> she just walked in. She was cancer abuse. I'm like, yeah. yeah. So I was thinking. It's like, what were you saying? That it would take off a little bit. I was thinking, how could you make me look worse? <laughs> Could you make me look like really dumb? How do you feel about blonde? <laughs> now she said at the end of her show, she said I was I was chatting during a clip that was playing, and you know we try to keep the show very PG thirteen. No one's concerned about the profanity; it's that you're a liar, mm -hmm. fraud, fraud, uh -huh. fraud, propagandist. Yeah, yeah. There's plenty, by the way, that you would find here during run through, which should never oh, yeah. see the light of day. Thankfully, but it would never be. <laughs> insincere <laughs> it would be authentically <laughs> worse heart, than yeah. what makes air yes, yes. sometimes we sit here and everyone go like we will run a bit and we'll go oh my god no <laughs> <laughs> i'm sorry about that yes all the time <laughs> so but you wouldn't hear me saying ah jeff joe Biden, he just can't stop doing good I just, you know, at some, <laughs> you would never hear that. <laughs> it's that she doesn't believe what she's selling. She's like, I said a bad word. No one oh. gives, no one cares. You think oh. we look at you with those silly acrylic nails and that hairdo and think that you speak like a choir boy? No, it's that you're a liar. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Biden's like, ugh, I should open that border. Yes. yes. <laughs> Maybe some of them will be stylists. So it got worse. <laughs> Uh, for MSNBC when E. Jean Carroll, this is a woman who Donald Trump did not rape, Ugh. appeared on um, uh, Mr. Rachel Maddow's show, ranted about how she would spend, which looks really bad <laughs> when you try and say this isn't just about money, uh -huh. then bragging about how you want to spend the lawsuit money. And here she is yeah. um, dressed in the uh, Thanksgiving uh, table skirt. You've talked about using some of <laughs> Trump's money that you're about to get um, to help Ugh. shore up women's rights. Do you know what that might be, what that might look yes, like? Yes, Rachel. Yes. Tell me. Yes. I had such, such great ideas for all the good What's I'm going to do with this money. First thing, Rachel, you and I are going to go shopping. <laughs> We're going to get completely new wardrobes, new shoes, motorcycle for Crowley, section? new fishing rod for Robbie. <laughs> Rachel, what do you want? Penthouse? <laughs> it's yours, Nothing. Rachel. Penthouse and uh, France? You want France? You nothing. want to go fishing nope. in France? No? She said oh. nothing. All right, all right, okay. Pretend That's to just... laugh. <laughs> By the way, don't you love how she's picking out the least feminine things ever? She's like, a new fishing rod for this bitch and a motorcycle yeah. for this bitch. <laughs> Why a fishing rod? <laughs> yeah, you, you, you three are regular penthouse letters. Yeah. <laughs> They're gonna, they got to go shopping, but just to talk to the manager. Yes, exactly. Yeah. They both have that haircut. Listen, and... I want to look. This is you said you said festive. This is the Thanksgiving tablecloth. I wanted to look like the Christmas table. Don't forget to point like this. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Their fingers. Off. Gross. Oh, man. Did you see her finger? It's like yes. broken or something. Yeah, like she's you know, tea I, grabbing Reese's pieces. After seeing that, I am convinced. I do believe that is Donald Trump's type. Yes, that is Donald Trump's <laughs> type. You know, so she goes, we're going to go shopping. So they, where, they go to another dressing room and pretend to get assaulted by somebody? Yeah, exactly. Right. Yeah, exactly. Cool. Exactly. Well, I mean, you know, and I do think Rachel Maddow will take her up and, you know, she'll be going on a spree at Men's Warehouse. Unfortunately <laughs> for E. Jean Carroll, you're going to like the way you scissor. For E. Jean Carroll, the settlement... <laughs> It's actually $83 million in Trump NFTs. So that, she's not happy about it. That would explain the frowny. Oh, jeez. That would explain ah, the frowny. Ah, but the space suit Trump, that was a good one. It was? That was yeah. a good one. Ah. You can make money off of it. Rare. Watch Ladder with Crowder live, Monday through Thursday, 10 a.m. Eastern.